Welcome to another Gaging Gadgets YouTube Creator Tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a very simple subscription overlay using Canva. So as you can see here in my videos, I have a subscription overlay come in from the side, sits in the middle, it reminds people what channel they're on, and also asks them to subscribe to my channel. I found this to be a great way to remind people to subscribe to my channel without being too disruptive to the content. The subscription overlay we create in this video is very easy because it does not require any green screen editing when you add it to your video. And one quick thing to note before we get started, I will not be showing you how to add this to your videos in editing software simply because the instructions to do that would be very specific to whatever software you're using to edit your YouTube videos, but I will show you exactly how I use Canva to create this subscription overlay for free. All right, so to get started, the first thing we need to do is simply go to canva.com. And while I have a premium version, you can follow the same steps using a free version of Canva. But if you're interested in getting a premium version, check the description. I'll have a link down there that gives you 30 days of Canva premium for free. Once you get to Canva, create an account or log in and go up to the top right and select create a design. Once the new menu opens, go down and select custom size. And I like to do a width of 600 with a height of 150. Now you can choose your own size, but I found this size works great on my videos. Once you've done that, select create new design. The first thing I do once I have the size configured is go into the left sidebar, select background, and then I just choose black. In my opinion, the contrast really helps people see it over your video. Once I change the background to black, I then add my logo to it so that people can recognize it as my channel. And to do that in the left sidebar, all we need to do is go to uploads, Upload media, find the logo on your computer, and upload it. From there, we can simply drag and drop it onto the overlay, and I like to have it on the left side. Next, I like to try to recreate the subscription button that is on YouTube. We can easily do that in Canva by first going to Elements in the left sidebar, then under Lines and Shape, select See All, and now we just want to scroll down until we see the square with the rounded sides. Select it, and then it will add it to your overlay right here. What we need to do is kind of just change the shape and size of this so that it looks like a button on YouTube. Currently the size I have is around 160 by 46. So you can kind of change the size to whatever you want it to be, but basically that ratio should work. Once I have the rectangle there, I go ahead and change the color to red. Like that. Now we just need to add the text that says subscribe to it. So go ahead and the left sidebar, select text, then choose add a heading. And we just wanna move that over the new subscribe button and type subscribe. The font I use for subscribe on my button is Montserrat Semi Bold. So select that font. In the top menu for the text, I like to change it to bold. Once I do that, then I select the three dots for more and I go ahead and change it to all caps. From there, we can just make it the text bigger until it looks like it fits in correctly. So 15 works for me. Then I center it, and there we go. We have our subscribe button. After that, to make it look more like the actual subscribe button, I add my channel name and then the number of subscribers I currently have. So to do that, I use the text tool on the left sidebar, and then I add a subheading right here. First, we're going to do the channel name, Gaging Gadgets. And for that, I use the font Roboto. And on the channel name, I bold the text. Now we just need to make this larger, something that's easily visible to the viewer. After that, we can add the number of subscribers, or you can add any text you want, maybe like and comment, anything like that that you want. And for that, I'm just going to add another subheading under the channel name currently have 170,000 subscribers. Make sure the font is Roboto. And then I leave that unbolded and I just make that a little larger so that it fits in with the text there. Now in my subscription overlay, I do have a cursor that goes up and selects the subscribe button. And to add that, it's very easy. All we need to do is go into the left sidebar, select elements, and then just search mouse click if you want it to be animated like mine, what I recommend doing is going into the filter right here and search animated. And you'll see a couple different ones like these fingers that move, these cursors. They have tons of different options that you can use on your videos, depending on the style that you're looking for. I think in this one, I'm going to use this hand right here. So we can change the size of it to allow it to fit. And in order for me to add this animated clip here, 
I'm going to have to just move my subscription button over a little bit. So I'll do that real quick. And there we go. So you really just want to play with it. Whatever fits your style, you can make things larger if you need to, to fill in the gaps here. Once you've added all the elements and text and your logo to your subscription overlay, if you want to add any animations, all you need to do is go up into the top menu, select animate, and then they have some different animations that you can use that will help grab people's attention when you show your subscription overlay. When you're selecting, you can configure how long this will last. So I like to do about eight seconds. And for this one, I'm just going to select rise. So now I'm done. I've created my subscription overlay in Canva. To download it, all I need to do is go up into the top right, select share, go down to download, and then you want to make sure that you're downloading it as an MP4 video. Just select download. It's going to render that video for you. Then you can download it and you can add it to your YouTube videos and hopefully get more subscribers. All right, so that's how you create a custom subscription overlay for your YouTube videos using Canva. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you'd like to see more YouTube creator tips and tutorials, check the links in the description. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel, Gaging Gadgets, for more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.